And uh, my fifth sibling says that I am now an old man. And since he is almost a generation older than me, you know what that makes him. But he called me for my birthday on November the 1st. So I'm not going to tell him happy birthday, A, because it's not his birthday. And two, I would like to follow his example and I will call him sometime in the future of November 27th. I just have a few things. Uh, many of you have heard me talk about him in the past, so I'm not going to repeat, I hope, any of those things. But um, as he's aged and is aging, he has learned a lot of new lessons. Um, if you've ever sent an email to him and he's ever had the time to respond. He has a very interesting email language. He has learned how to use, as he calls it, his cell telephone. And texting is, I don't think, a degree that's being offered anymore. But if it is ever offered, even online, maybe that's a school he should enroll in. Because <laughs> his text language Thank you, unique to say the very least. I have uh, other brothers and I've, I've observed them with him in the, through my life. And my oldest brother Timothy and he um, were best men at each other's weddings. But if you ever hear them in discussion, you would maybe ask why. Because often they will have debates and discussions and, and they have arguments over who has the most authority and who knows the most about the scripture. My younger brother and he share something that he and I don't, and that's volume. And they always have very spirited, uh, this is the word I'm gonna make up, voluminous <laughs> discussions. Not voluminous, it's loud. It's just uh, the volume, the decibel level is, is uh, unknown. Uh, and then he and I, we don't have as many debates because I'm so humble. <laughs> but if we ever, yeah, we tie. But when we do have them, they're usually over some historical inaccuracy that he may have suggested that it's my place to correct it. But always in private, I would never get up and do that. Um, finally, um, if you ever have the opportunity to participate in any sort of competitive activity with him, always choose to be on his team. Because 99.9% .9 of the time, your team is going to win. Bill Russell spent a period as player coach of the Celtics. My brother often is the player referee. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.